Welcome back everyone. Today we are delving into a legal saga that's captivated the nation for decades. The contentious battle between O.J. Simpson's state and the family of Ron Goldman continues to stir debate and controversy. Let's dive in. As the world knows, O.J. Simpson, the former football star turned actor, was acquitted of the murders of Nicole Brown Simpson and Ron Goldman in a highly publicized trial in 1995. However, in a subsequent civil trial, Simpson was found liable for the wrongful deaths of uh, Brown and Goldman. The Goldman family was awarded a substantial sum in damages, yet much of it remains unpaid. Now with Simpson's passing, the focus has shifted to his state, reignited the legal um, battle. The question on many minds is, should Simpson's children be held responsible for the actions of their father? Supporters of the Goldman family argue that justice demands accountability, while others believe it's unfair to burden Simpson's heirs. Emotions run high on both sides of the debate. Some say that paying the Goldman's only would uh, perpetuate a cycle of pain and suffering, while others insist that it's the right thing to do to honor Ron Goldman's memory. As the legal wrangling continues, one thing remains clear, the legacy of O.J. Simpson and the tragic events of 1994 continue to cast a long shadow over all involved. Thank you for joining us today as we explore the complex and emotional legal saga. What are your thoughts on the ongoing battle between O.J. Simpson's state and the Goldman's family? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more in-depth discussion on legal issues and current events. Until next time, take care.